Shanti, Shanti, Shanti. <clears throat> Are you coming out from inside to outside when I'm chanting Om Shanti, Shanti, Shanti? You see, that is how the, your awareness will start working one day. Um, Shanti, Shanti, Shanti. Um, Shanti, Shanti, Shanti. Wonderful practice you all have done. Bring your mind to the right hand, your mind to the left hand. Lift your both of arms, place it on your eyes, open the eyes inside. Know your experiences inside the arms and then bring the hands down to share your experiences, my friends. Let us start with David and Jerry. Uh, very, um, very, very peaceful, very deep, very fast, very simple. <laughs> Not very. <laughs> yes, mind says it very fast. It should have been, oh, little more. That is the beauty. Wonderful. How are you, Jerry? Similar, sir. I, it's from the beginning to end. It was quiet and calm and peaceful and timeless. Yeah. Timeless. Beautiful. See that? Uh, just start working. Just become aware. Om, inside, out. Outside, in. In our daily life from today. And see the change. How are you, Lara? We are applying the principle of Gita, step by step. I am good. It's really quick. The meditation just like flies by. It's like I close my eyes and then I'm out. Oh, um, beautiful. Yeah, it's just really fast. So, yeah. yeah. And then I had a vision of an eyeball at one point, just for a second. That's good. And then it went away. That's good. Yeah. Running very fast, obviously, that means that the mind has entered into the state of timelessness. We spend more or less the same time. How are you, Terry, my friend? No, unmute first. That is the beauty of tech. If you don't want to listen, just mute it. But here, unmute it. <laughs> uh, can you unmute it? Don't get upset. Don't worry. It is only a matter. Matter does not know what we are doing to it. And the matter does not uh, live in the conscious state. In the meantime, let us start with the Stephen. Uh, like like everybody else's um, description, it was uh, it was quick. It was timeless. It was um, thoroughly. It was enjoyable. I'm 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 very content. Um, very good. Yes, all, all 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 is good. Beautiful, beautiful. That is what it should happen. How are you, Christina? Meeting you after a long time. Hi, yes, I'm so happy to be back. Um, I've been trying to trying to be on, but I couldn't get my video. Um, so I've been here, but not here all the way. So it was nice to fully be here. And I feel like um, I, I didn't feel like it was super quick. I, I feel like I always feel like that. But I, I really liked how you said in the beginning to have the past karma needs to be exhausted of life. So that's kind of what I 
focused on on trying to do and I felt like the heaviness in my like I had my palms open and I felt what I was really trying to just exhaust it all it all went to my hands and I felt so heavy and then all of a sudden I felt like I was holding myself up like I was floating so it was yeah. like this weird I let it go and then I was holding myself up so that was I don't know that that's, was a, good, really that's cool. a beautiful that's a good experience yeah I think everyone a uh, couple of uh, weeks and months before everyone used to narrate those experiences because you join uh, you join free uh, sell them that is why you have those experiences in this meditation. I think Lara, David, Jerry, Stephen, and everyone has those sense of experiences of floating, heaviness, lightness. One thing I have to add when you said something about past karma. Past karma needs to be exhausted in the state of calmness. Past karma needs to be exhausted in the state of tamsik and rajsik guna. That means in the state of anger, anxiety, duality, and a conflict. So when it is exhausted in the later state, then it accumulates more and more karma. And when it is exhausted by understanding consciously, in meditation, uh, it releases our impressions quickly, fastly, and it goes a long way. Now I have to read. My meditation was a uh, Terry. Terry cannot uh, work on the device. My meditation was focused, and I was able to follow through the directions. I need practice. It was also calm and smooth and not long time. At one time, I forget where my hands were. Yeah, that is also a state of the timelessness. That is beautiful. We can see your smile, Terry, and we can get it. What you are perfectly normal. Do you see that last point? I have to make it that if it is possible in a meditative state, to bypass all the symptoms of Parkinson in meditation, then it is definitely possible all the time. And that is an awakened state. Or that is, you can say, a deeper and a higher meditative state. Work on that. Forget the rest. And don't ever think that you have this problem because you are not the body. You're not the body. Very good. That is all. Thank you.